All right, class crafters. Uh, it's nice to see that we've got some people on level 2, level 3, and our returning 6th graders. Some of them are already at level 6. So now you should have your Google Classroom uh, attached to your class craft because one of the brand new assignments just released last night is the follow-up on our class promises work that we did together in class. So you see it's got that Google Classroom icon. That means this assignment attaches to Google Classroom. So now that we've made the promises to each other and you work together uh, to come up with what are the top three promises you're going to make to make this year the best year ever to be in a safe, happy, and fun classroom, and hopefully in all your classes. So it's time to make a commitment and to start practicing. And we're going to reflect every now and then to make sure we're keeping up. So when you get a Google Classroom assignment, in the task section, it lists the instructions that are on Google Classroom. But I'm going to jump over to assignment and click on open Google Classroom, which are the directions I wrote here, just in case you forget. It's, it's easier to open it up in Google Classroom because it is a Google Classroom assignment. So you're going to click on the document that uh, I put your promises in. And here are the three promises that you voted on for students. And 6C has their own, 6B has their own, 6A has their own. They're different. And it's really cool to see what each class came up with. But they're all for the same uh, end goal to have a fun, happy, and safe classroom and the best year ever. And then here's what your teachers, I sent it to all your teachers, so now they will know what uh, you want. At least, as a class, your top three promises. So when you are ready, um, you're going to click on Add Comment to Al Gonzalez, and you're going to write down um, what you think about the activity and what you think about the promises we came up with because not all of you voted for these. Uh, so if, especially if you didn't vote for these, how are you? If you didn't get your top choice, are you good with these? These are the things you're going to write here. So write your thoughts about the promises we ended up with. And what you thought of the process. Was it a good process? Was it worthwhile? These, this is good feedback for me. And then you click and send it. Then you're going to mark as done. Now you've got it in Google Classroom. Now if you ever need to fix it, you unsubmit first and add another comment. So if I ever send it back, uh, you don't have to ask me for permission. You unsubmit yourself. You go back to Classcraft, and uh, this one's waiting on me. See how it doesn't have the, let's see, where's an example? There it is. See how it doesn't have the lightning bolt? Since it doesn't have the lightning bolt, you're waiting on me to read your response and approve it. That's it. 